Chris Windley here, the uh, Nine Figure Mentor. How are you today? Um, well, today I've got my suit on, um, which is a very rare event these days, but I actually uh, had to go out to a physical meeting. Yes, such a strange thing. Um, a physical meeting where I actually wear a suit and a tie as well. So, uh, very strange day. Um, and uh, it's been a, a bit of an SEO week um, for the last week or so, search engine optimization that is. Uh, last week I came across an SEO company that was operating both in the US and the UK um, and they had a great attitude, I've talked to, to you about them before, they had a great attitude and a great offer to clients. I really liked it. I mean their offer was uh, if we don't rank you um, in the top 10 uh, search terms on page one of Google um, for your keywords and phrases in three months, you can stop paying us. And if we don't do it in six months, then you get all your money back. I think that's an amazing offer. Um, and uh, I don't know how you can beat that, really. But... Um, the only thing, of course, that you have to do, which a lot of people struggle with, is to actually work out what your most important keywords and phrases are. Uh, and I can tell you that they're not uh, your company name. Um, they might be your um, key products and services. Um, anyway, uh, then on the Six Figure Mentors, and uh, Digital Experts Academy um, webinar call on Monday, we were talking about uh, successful traffic generation strategies. Um, and SEO was mentioned alongside uh, paid Facebook, YouTube, and Bing ads, as well as uh, Google ads, um, pay-per-click, and AdWords. Um, in that webinar, SEO was described as a very difficult strategy in comparison with uh, digital advertising. Now, certainly, YouTube and Facebook um, advertising have been great traffic generators for the SFM and DEA. Uh, in general terms, we at Centripetal can get like high-ranking positions using the uh, digital marketing ecosystem. Uh, for example, notably, we recently dominated searches for wealth management industry terms um, in London, um, particularly, um, even though we had not built a wealth management site. Uh, we were a wealth management focused site, if you like, you know, we were actually using the centripetal um, web and blog site to rank for wealth management terms. And um, we dominated some of those terms in about five days, uh, just to show people how the uh, digital marketing ecosystem actually worked. Uh, now, I've got a sort of like a rule of thumb, if you like, about ranking for search terms. Uh, I basically say, Ranking for terms that get hundreds of thousands or low millions of results, three, four, five million results is really easy. Um, and I really mean that. Using the DME, it's just easy. Um, however, uh, tens or hundreds even of millions of results is quite another matter. Uh, in that case, you may need to combine many different um, SEO techniques in order to achieve a dominant position and it may take a while. Um, now there's a, a reality uh, for anyone uh, ranking in Google if you like for uh, multi-million result terms uh, and that reality is that they're actually using a combination of all sorts of things. Um, so uh, they're not necessarily white hat or black hat, um, as they're called in the industry, but they're basically all tricks of the trade, if you like, um, technical knowledge, 
uh, and they all risk a change by Google. Uh, one of the main things that I always say to people to keep in mind is this, Google has customers uh, and it wants happy customers. If it doesn't have happy customers, um, then the business is not going to be going in the right direction. Happy customers, the definition of happy customers, put simply, if you like, are people who use Google search and they find the things that they want. Um, and what they want is quality information, products, and services. What they don't want is a load of rubbish. Um, they want value, and Google rewards people for providing value, and basically they penalize people for putting up rubbish in very simple terms. And that's the way I think um, you know, it's useful to look at it. So I hope that's been useful. Um, thanks very much for your time today. Uh, Nine-figure mentor here. Speak to you soon. All the best.